Good morning, Myrtle Beach Seahawks. Today is Thursday, October 12, 2023. Miss Rhodes, you know what? It says we have no birthdays, but we do have a special birthday today. It's my dog's birthday. He is nine years old today. Happy birthday, Mr. Gunner. I wish he could watch this. <laughs> Our outside activities forecast is rain. High, 63 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds northeast at 15 to 25 miles per hour. Our chance of rain is 100%. They got that one right. Rainfall may reach one inch. Your lunch choices today. Baked beef ziti, yogurt, turkey lunch bowl, or PB&J. Four great choices. What's happening? Please do not forget about our food drive. Bring in those non-perishable items and place them in the blue barrels by the front door. Help us fight hunger. On Friday, we are going to wear pink for breast cancer awareness. Charleston Rap Fundraiser Limo Ride is scheduled for Monday, October 16th. The winners will leave school in a limousine and ride to Mellow Mushroom, a great pizza place, for lunch. You will return around 1 p.m. If you sold 35 items, that's how you were included in this event or your name was entered into a drawing to attend the limo lunch. Student council applications are due tomorrow, Friday, October 13th. Do, 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 do. Read Marathon has begun. Don't forget to be logging your minutes each day. Read for enjoyment. If you read 200 minutes, that's a 5K. 400 minutes is a 10K. 800 minutes is a half marathon. 1,600 minutes is a full marathon. Please read, read, read. All right, our school wide read aloud distress signal. What does the team question yesterday was what does prickled mean in this sentence? Lavender's eyes prickled, thinking of her mom and dad. And the following classes know what it means Godfrey. Champlin, James, Wiggins, and Merritt. Miss James' class said it means that her eyes started to water from emotions. Today's team question. Looking back on the entire story, what was the most important thing for survival? What was the most important thing for survival? Ooh, that might be a hard one to figure out. All right, speaking of reading, we also have another reading challenge. Sweet Vines Reading Challenge. I know you love this one, boys and girls. Week six, Sweet Vines Reading Challenge winners are... Annie Benton in Miss Merritt's class. Wolf in Miss Carano's class. And my girl, Shabriki, in Miss Brellier's class. Come by the library to get your giant bag of candy. Will you join the Sweet Finds Reading Challenge next? For the morning news, I'm Miss Lee. Thanks for watching. Have a tremendous Thursday, Seahawks.